boom world what is going on coming through with another review it's that time breaking down these adidas terex shoes hiking shoes uh i purchased these to wear them specifically for work as a delivery driver so they pretty much get daily wear uh for the most part for the past past six months so yeah let's break it down uh i've been waiting for the six month mark to make this video i've been gradually uh watching them break down i should have been documenting it but it is what it is you're gonna get what they are at six months so yeah as you can see definitely coming apart these have gone through rain snow dry weather uh, hills, um, yeah, so pretty much I wear them every day for work, uh, besides, like, days that they were soaked from the day prior, and there's just no way I was gonna wear them, so I had, like, a pair of backup boots, but, yeah, for the most part, uh, I delivered in these for six months, um, uh, Adidas, Terex, um, I got them on sale, so pretty much any hiking shoe or whatever, like, shoes with a good grip, uh, is what I was looking for, for, like, sliding and stuff like that, I guess, and not falling, uh, in situations that would make you fall, I don't know what I'm saying, but, um, yeah, um, overall, uh, they are comfortable, uh, they won't keep your feet dry if they get wet, like, instant, uh, soaked, and I guess that's, uh, more than knit, and I guess they are meant for hiking and not delivery work, but, uh, yeah, I, they're black, so that's pretty much why I went with them, because I needed black footwear for my job. Um, see, shredded just from sliding my foot in and out. The heels. Um, yeah. This, uh, material hasn't coming off as much as, uh, the other foot. This one, like... Gra gradually it's been peeling up um uh, we've recently had a rain uh and that definitely uh affected it more um i'm going to keep wearing them for a little bit more just because they're not fully destroyed uh and they are comfy uh, they do do the job still so as long as they stay dry uh at this point uh i will keep wearing them the grips on the bottom uh they definitely don't help that much uh, in the wet when it comes to slipping on wet surfaces. Uh, yeah, pretty much. Uh, soles though, that is a plus. They are, what, like this, it hasn't separated or anything, so that's cool. Just, I guess, gradual wear and tear. Um, I don't know, they both have like these holes. I, maybe that's my toe poking it or something. I'm not, I'm not too sure. Uh, functionality, uh, maybe if you weren't, uh, wearing them for work or delivery, uh, and just, like, wearing them to hike, they definitely would be, like, a nine, like, a top, like, a fine shoe to wear for hiking or whatever. Um, as far as delivery, uh, review-wise, uh, they are comfortable, uh, not much ankle support, uh, they definitely are wearing pretty decently. I guess they, I would say they're in better condition uh, than the Vans MTE that I wore for six months prior. So yeah, these uh, for when it comes to like delivery work, wearing them every day, I'd probably put them at like six. They also uh, don't provide any protection for your toes. So if uh, you kick something or something falls on your foot, it's not going to help you there. But um, yeah, Adidas, uh, they're all right shoes uh, for work. They also smell terrible. My face is right here, and that's just from getting wet and drying. There's nothing really you could do about it, I guess, unless you put stuff inside of it to make it not smell. But otherwise, bleh. thank you, thank you. Um, I bought a pair of DC skate shoes, uh, which would be the first time I've ever purchased DC skate shoes for, and I'm I got those for work, just in case you know. You ever need a kick rope or something while you're on a job? 
Uh, so yeah, I wore them uh, a couple times at work because these were soaked and my other shoes were soaked. <laughs> no support. That's about it. They're styling now. Till next time, world.